Hey everybody, Banang here, how you doing? Today I'd like to talk to you about this card you can see right here, Sivril the Exile. Um, I had an Arena Gauntlet draft yesterday where I was more or less forced to pick him because the other two epics were even worse. And um, at first I wasn't very convinced about this card because nobody plays it in Constructed. I certainly never did. And I thought, well, in worst case it's a ranged minion, right? And in best case maybe I can make some use of uh, the utility. And boy, did I make use of this utility. Um, I played Vitruvian and uh, surprisingly enough it had lots and lots of great synergies with uh, Vitruvian. Because um, I had, with Vitruvian you have, for example, Entropic Decays and Dominate Wills that good opponents will play around. But with Sivril they can't play around these spells anymore because you can just pull them, pull them to you. Also, if you have, if you place some obelisks at the corner, it doesn't matter and if the enemy runs away because uh, Sivril just pulls his opponents to the obelisk again so your dervishes can attack those. In Gauntlet, positioning is very very important. Maybe even more important than in, uh, in, excuse me, than in Constructed because spell removals are much much more rare than in uh, Constructed and it's important to have good minion placement so your minions can hit theirs or your minions avoid theirs whatever, and Sivril just really messes up your opponent's placements. And um, yeah, in worst case, it was only, only a ranged minion that my opponent went over their head to, to get rid of. They spent so many resources just to deal with it and didn't have enough resources left to deal with my other big, huge threat minions. And in the best case, it was just amazing and it netted me many many wins in this run. I'm just gonna showcase you some games I had with this Vitruvian run. In the future I definitely will try it out with other factions and see how good it can be. But for now, uh, Vitruvian, I really really like picking this card. So yeah, have fun with Eclipse. Unfortunately the, the voice is not synced again because I had to download it from Twitch because I forgot to record again. So I hope you, uh, you can astonish me for that and uh, I will see you guys next time. Have fun and see you. Bye. Maybe ditch that for this for now. No, 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 I love, I love obelisks. If I had gotten like Fireblaze obelisk, I would have picked it immediately. It's just, I didn't. <laughs> and Windstorm obelisk is really bad. It's... No, it's not really bad, but I don't like it. I don't... Whoa. Okay. Is he, is he taking all three mana? Holy shit. Holy shit. Fuck, man. What's that? Winx. That's a strange play because I can kill the Winx. So this one can't attack, yeah. Nice. I like this. The Sivril is better than I expected. Here. He's at 4 mana. What, what can he do with 4 mana? <laughs> okay, that's very interesting, Kung Fu Dojo. Um, new tiles, so old tiles can be overwritten. Yeah, that's interesting. Oh wow, really? Oh man, this guy is, uh, this guy is swarming, like swarming a lot. Okay, I have to try to conserve my health here. Just...
Just play the biggest dude I have. Mach das. Okay, okay, this dude killed. Huh? Hm? Nein, 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 keine Sorge, ich, ich, ich streame gerade. Achso, sorry. Alles gut. Tausend Millionen Zuschauer schon. Ja! <lacht> ich bin mega riesen. Aha. Aha. Now that's very interesting. I'm thinking of doing this. Use the wind shroud to kill it. Oh shit. It got it got my absolutely best minion. <laughs> oh fuck. Oh fuck. Holy shit, I can't believe how lucky this guy is. Oh man, oh man, that pop though. <laughs> no. Maybe I should have Primus Fist and kill that. Free kill that. And um, I don't know, I don't know. Seriously? And he gets that? Seriously? <laughs> Holy shit, yo. Oh, nice! I'll take that. Nice. That's a lucky, lucky, lucky draw here. this game to be over but it, apparently some RNG gods are still on my side oh fuck that's not the smartest thing to do it's true he does kill the big threat dudes but now I can pen him in completely, like this, this, this. There is one spot where it can spawn good. Nope, not happening here. Not today. Okay, I, I lose when he has another Shadow Nova. Wow, nice. this death blighter provoke come on give me a provoke <laughs> oh man oh man if I can if I can take this game back that would be amazing
that doesn't do anything. Wow. Really? Wait, is that lethal? It's one, two, three, six, ten, yeah. Oh man, oh man, I can't believe this. Ugh. Shit happens. Oh, that's not too bad. This denies, yeah. This With this I can deny a mana orb of his and then play a Venomoth. So wherever he plays, yeah. Whoa, holy shit. <sighs> that was a really, really difficult decision here. I was thinking do get some value. Come on, come on. RNG. Nice. Oh, okay. Okay. But that's still not very good. I can still trade in here, get a 5 drop, let me get rid of this one. Wow. Okay, that's what I'm gonna do. So, dispel this, play a ranged bag here, this kills that. Might as well go face here. <laughs> yeah, Grove Keeper is pretty good. But actually, honestly, I, w I expected Grove Keeper to be even better because um, normally, yeah, you see lots of uh, provokes in Gauntlet, like Primus Shieldmaster and that kind of stuff. Today, however, has not been the case. Another cat? But why? Feels so bad to waste a, gr a dancing, dancing blades here. Does he have another cat? Oh, okay. Oh wow, that's how much he wants to kill the range dude. I, mean, I can I can completely understand why he would why he would want to do that. Oh shit, did I miscalculate? Oh, I thought I could play the flame wing afterwards too. Oh, damn it. Ah, oh, floating three mana doesn't feel too good really bad actually. <laughs> wow. Not bad. Not bad. Yeah. I think I'm gonna do that.
that. Hey, Zelda! You're back! Good to see you back, man. Let me add you to my friends list so I can always see when you're online. Oh, did he? Oh, nice. Conceded. Nice, nice, nice. So I am. Oh, okay. Oh, this is my single dispel. <clears throat> my single dispel. I'm gonna keep everything. Alright. That's rather unexpected. Oh wow, oh wow. He's just playing the runaway tactic here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what I'm thinking too. Sivra. Uh, what's better, Sivra? Yeah, I think I, I, I will, I'm gonna play the Sivra. And hope for a good Windshroud spawn. Nice. <laughs> oh man, this, this guy is just running away. And it's surprisingly uh, effective. Wow. Okay. Not too bad. Let's ditch the Star's Fury. I wanted to say next that next turn is not uh, seven mana yet, so. Whoa, okay. Take that. <laughs> I've recorded that. Such a good, um, good showcasing for the Hollow Gravekeeper. I'm gonna take a little break here after after opening the pack break and then uh, if Zelda has time we're gonna collaborate for a, a draft and a few games <laughs> 